with that car? Allow me to examine him. Stay away from him, Torvus. I don't trust you. Let me explain, Captain. Unless Earth has changed so much in my absence that the accused no longer has a chance to defend himself, the Phantom Warrior invasion caught us by surprise. We had no chance to retreat. Others captured before didn't decide to cooperate with the enemy. Perhaps they would have. If their only daughter had also been captured and held hostage, Lecklin was my only child. They threatened to harm her if I didn't help them trap you. I know it's not an excuse, but it is an explanation. I guess we'll just have to get your daughter back for you. What's it look like, Yannick? It's not a hundred percent, but it'll get us back to Nautilus. But our defense shields cannot withstand an attack. That's good enough. You and Dr. Torbus take the cruiser. Dakar and I will use the transport. Dr. Torbus placed a microtransmitter on his daughter's fingernail before they were taken captive. According to this receiver, she's being held in Phantom Warrior Space Station 659. Why do I get the feeling we three amigos are heading there? We'll put on the spare Phantom Warrior uniforms in the cruiser we brought back. Fly it to the station, get Dr. Torbus' daughter out, and bring her back here. Really? Simple as that? <laughs> There's nothing simple about it, Ned. Which is why I'm asking you and Dakar to volunteer to go with me. Well, I just hope the uniform fits. Hey, I know what you mean, hombre. I like my threads to look hot, too. The commander of the operation on Junkar will be severely reprimanded for letting Torvus escape his clutches. I'm taking personal charge of this operation, Captain Forty. Yes, Metallic. Dr. Torvus's daughter is being held in his cell. <gasps> oh. You have nothing to fear, child. We only desire your father's cooperation. My father will never work for the Phantom Warriors. Perhaps you are right. Take the girl to the cryoscan laboratory. No! No! Take it away from me! Oh, kind of makes you jumpy, having all these enemigos around. Masks down. Stick close. It might get hot in there. This side corridor. I dentoscope reveals non phantom warriors. Remain where you are. Yeah, right. Quick, this way. I don't think so. Surprise! This is what I call bringing down the house. Wait, let's try this one. We're 50 feet from her. Ned, set the timer on the floor try bomb for six minutes. In six minutes, this place goes up in smoke. Let's get the girl. She's in the room on the other side. Let's do it. I don't 
get it. The receiver locked onto Lechlin's transmitter and showed us she was... Nemo, this is Metallic. I've been expecting you. Our cryo scan revealed the transmitter on the girl's fingernail. It's been deactivated. On the other hand, we've duplicated the transmitter and spread dozens of them throughout the station. I have Torbus's daughter with me in the war room. Unless you surrender, he will never see her again. Welcome, Nemo. I knew you'd come. You humans are so predictable. Captain Nemo. It is nice to be recognized. Enjoy it while you can, Nemo. Because no one will recognize the dust you're about to become. Destroy them. Destroy me and you destroy yourself. I've set a chlordry bomb to explode in four minutes. You're bluffing. You'd never take a chance of hurting the girl. It's you who can't take the chance, Metallic. If anything happens to her, you lose control over Dr. Torvus. Oh! Tell me where the bomb is, or I'll... Three and a half minutes left, Metallic. Destroy them, then abandon the station. A dud to be precise. To the landing dock. All personnel are to abandon the station immediately. Abandon the station immediately. Be still. At least you'll survive. Oh. Going somewhere metallic. Ned Lamb, the courageous first officer of the North. Prepare to meet your friend. Get her out of here! But that's an order, Dakar! So, Nemo, just you and me. I wouldn't have it any other way. Abandon space station. Attention all personnel. Abandon space station. This is not a drill. Abandon space station. One minute left till the bomb goes off. This is madness. We'll both be destroyed. We don't have to be. We can take your ship out of here together. Agreed. Put your weapon down. Put your weapon down. We don't have time to argue. Step on it, Metallic, or we'll be Astro Dust. Ned will blast you to pieces if I'm gone. Ned, come into range and I'll link up with your cruiser. It's all because of Captain Nemo, Father. He was like one of those knights in shining armor that you read about, swooping down, rescuing me. Captain daughter and I owe you our lives. We were just doing our job, Dr. Torbus. And so you can do yours. We'll drop you and Lecklin at the nearest Earth space station and say our farewells. I think I'll say my goodbyes now. The sooner the better. Friendship for all. No, you're right, Victory. Friendship for all. <laughs>